Hi, welcome to the New Wave Cooking Club. I'm Jennifer, the executive chef for New Wave Oven. Today we're gonna do the easiest shortbread and we're gonna top it with some strawberries. So the first thing we're gonna do is, uh, I bought strawberries. I'm gonna sweeten them up a little bit by adding just a little bit of sugar and giving them a toss. And while we're making our baking mix, these will solidify a little bit and we'll have a nice little syrup. So let's put those off to the side. Okay, so what I did is I took my favorite baking mix. I'm gonna add some sugar to that. Now guys, I wanted to tell you, this is for liquid measuring and this is for dry ingredients. A lot of times people use this and they wonder why the recipe doesn't come out right. Um, all dry ingredients should be used in the cups and liquid should be done in the glass or the, okay. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna cut in some butter. I use unsalted butter when I bake. And if you do use salted butter, it's okay, but especially if you're using another recipe that has salt in it, which this one doesn't, we, um, you know, you'd wanna cut back on the salt. So what we're gonna do is just mix this in with a fork to get nice little little balls, incorporate it. Then we're gonna add some milk. And it's gonna seem like it's not enough um, liquid, but it, it all works in. Then what we're gonna do is we're gonna actually just bake these right on the liner pan. That's an awesome, awesome, awesome feature for this oven that you can put foods right on the liner pan and, and cook. So we're gonna incorporate this. So we've got it all incorporated. Now let me grab a glove here. And I'm gonna make, I'm gonna make medium to large and we're gonna just put them right here on the liner pan, just kind of Form them, push them down a little bit. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna bake these, oh, between 10 and 12 minutes. There we go. I would say these are pretty much the large size, so probably go the full 12 minutes. That's the, the thing about New Wave, is once you find times that work for you, inside my cupboard, I keep a, a piece of paper with all the times that work really well uh, for certain foods, especially like steaks and, and whatnot. That's just a good little tip. Okay, so we've got our shortcakes on there. We're going to just simply touch and go 12 minutes. Cook time, one, two, touch and go. And I'll see you back here in 12 minutes. All right, our shortcakes are done. Look at how beautiful those are. Yum, yum. So all I'm gonna do is take my plate. You can let them cool off. We like them hot at my house. Get a couple of them on there. Just see how nice and flaky it is. Okay. Our strawberries have, have a nice little liquid going. So we're just going to pour them on the top. However you wanna do it. Then I, just for fun, I fan a few strawberries and what I do is I just take a strawberry and I make nice little thin cuts kind of fun. People always think it's fancy. Just do a few little cuts there. And then, of course, the whipped cream. And I'm going to put most of the whipped cream on the strawberries because the shortcakes are still hot. And then tap it just a little bit. And there you have it. The easiest shortcake recipe ever. Until next time, have a great day.